digital cookie can help you make sure that you have enough cookies for your orders, track your progress on delivering, selling offline orders, and or make sure that your records of cookies received agrees with what your true cookie volunteer has given your Girl Scout. To learn more, go to your My Cookies tab. The top part of your dashboard shows the total number of packages that have been allocated to your Girl Scout from the true cookie volunteer. It could include booth sales or troop sales. It is not the same as the number of cookies you are personally responsible for. The inventory section gives you a quick view of how many cookies you should still have available and how many you may need to fill your in-person orders. The first thing to note is my offline sales. This is something that needs to be updated by the Girl Scout and her caregiver when she delivers cookies and receives a cash or check payment for them. If they are not entered in this section, they will not be removed from her inventory and this section will not be correct. To enter offline sales, click the plus or minus buttons or enter the number of offline cookies for each variety. When you've entered the correct numbers, click Save Updates. The system will walk you through what your offline sales was previously, what you're adding now, and the new total. If it is correct, click Yes Update. There are three other sections that calculate your inventory. The first is the current inventory section. Clicking the arrow or the bar drops down your inventory. You'll see the total number of packages next to each category. If you see specialty one and two, those are cookies that are at a higher price than the rest of the other cookies. Check with your troop cookie volunteer for more information on which varieties are considered specialty or specialty two. By clicking on the additional category, another drop down appears. The received section comes from the information the troop cookie volunteer has of how many cookies you have received and signed for in the Baker system. If you believe there is an error in this, please contact your Troop Cookie Volunteer. The delivered section will reflect the offline sales the girl has entered above, any sales the Girl Scout made on her mobile app using the Give Cookies to a Customer Now feature, and any girl delivered orders that have been delivered and marked delivered to her customer on the Orders tab. The next section, Pending Delivery to Approve, shows how many cookies you need to fill girl delivery orders you have approved and girl delivery orders that you have yet to approve. You can see the unapproved numbers and the undelivered items you've already approved um, numbers here. The final section is inventory needed. This will show if you need any packages of cookies to fill your orders. Expanding any of the sections will show you how many you need and why. To know what varieties are needed, you will have to review your orders tab and then work to secure more cookies to fill those orders. If you have questions about any of the numbers of received orders in your current inventory section, ask your Troop Cookie Volunteer for more information. Remember, it may take the volunteer a few days to enter transactions, so be patient if you have received cookies from the Troop that need to be entered.